At the University of Melbourne, we welcome and celebrate members from all backgrounds, ages, faiths and genders. Together we are committed to providing safe, inclusive and respectful campuses where you can be part of a thriving and inspiring living and learning community. We encourage you to take advantage of your time here to meet new people and discover new interests by getting involved in the many activities and events that are run throughout the course of the year. But as in all large and diverse communities, sometimes things can go wrong and need to be addressed. In 2017, the Australian Human Rights Commission reported on its survey into sexual assault and sexual harassment at Australian universities. We're working together to enact all recommendations and to build a stronger community of respect. The university is committed to providing a safe and respectful living and learning environment for all students. Please be assured you will be heard and supported. This must be more than just official action. We need the cooperation of each of you. We are working with the Respect Task Force and through other channels across the university to improve policy and practice around preventing the responding to sexual violence. The Save a Community program is here to help students who have experienced or who have witnessed concerning behaviours such as discrimination, sexual harassment or bullying. We are also here to support students who have experienced sexual assault and family violence. We've set up a respect task force with strong representation from students, academic experts, colleges and professional staff, supported by a full-time project officer to make sure that we're implementing the messages that you sent to us in the survey. The university has a range of free support services for our student community. These support services include counselling and psychological services and the university's health service. We also have campus community. We can help you find accommodation or access a student loan. The university is committed to diversity and equity. This includes supporting our international and LGBTIQ students, who we know can face additional challenges. But we know that the task is not finished yet. Over the coming years, we'll be prioritising supervisor training, ensuring that those students who are on external placements are equally protected as students on campus, and really trying to convey to all our staff and students that they should feel safe and confident in reporting these incidences and knowing that they'll be taken seriously. And the GSA representatives are currently working on committees to decide what our training will look like at the university. It's also important that we support our peers and look after each other. When we observe some inappropriate behaviours, if it's safe to do so, we should try and stop it. But remember to take care of yourself as well. We also know that many postgraduate students who are victims of sexual violence are unwilling to speak up because they fear they will experience negative professional consequences for doing so. Our students should be protected from assault and harassment and fully supported to report incidents of sexual violence and be confident that they will be respected and heard. We need to work as a community to make these changes. When the wrong thing is happening, silence is acceptance. No matter who you are, if you see it, call it out and we will listen.